Alright guys, welcome back to another episode of Pixelmon Single Player. So last episode we got our cute little Cyndaquil right there, as you can see. He is a little cutie. Now we're not going to level him up just yet. We might if we don't find Totodile or Chikorita. So last episode was a little bit of a hunt for the Johto starters. We only really found about 10 Cyndaquils and pretty much that's it. So I double checked and the Totodile is in the river just like... Uh, Squirtle on the river, but it has to spawn on land So we're gonna try and look around for him for a bit if we don't find him uh, soon enough We're just gonna bail uh, But uh, yeah, we might just do the whole Cyndaquil level up episode um, Look for more starters. I'm just trying to think of the best place to look for this guy I mean like I said um, last episode. I think it was I found a totodile off screen like right there But that was while I was not recording so, I mean, I really want to try and get that going. I also would like to do a little bit of a boss hunt, try and find a couple of these new items. Might be a bit helpful to get some of them. Oh, I thought you were a red boss. You're cruel. But uh, we really should be finding some bosses. I mean, they've added a new tier, the green one. Uh, we actually found that last episode. So hopefully we can find another one of them. Um, I really, really want a shiny Pokemon. Um, I was thinking of getting out Flygon. Now, I don't think I have a Flygon. Actually, that's what we're going to do, guys. We're going to get a Flygon. I actually don't have a Flygon, I've only got, I think actually I've recorded all of them on the Pokedex. So I don't think I've caught any of them. And uh, we still have that issue with Matang being the only one, no Beldums yet. So I might just have to Pokespawn one in, just because it's um, not spawning at the, in this update. Um, so we'll, we'll see what happens there. But uh, there's Charmander. Oh, he has a new graphics update. Let's have a quick little peek at the new retextured Charmander. Actually, I think I might go get out all of my Kanto starters this episode and show off all those guys, actually. That sounds like a really good idea. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to get them all out. Let's let's show them off. See what they look like. All of them. Ready? Let's get that out. God, this guy's so slow now. He used to be so fast, but now he's just slow. Um, let me just check before we go in. What's that? It's a knit arena. Really small one. Spiros, Pidgeys. Oh, I can't wait for them to remodel Pidgeotto and Pidgeot. It's going to be great. Um, so that's still Extreme Hills. Yeah, no, we're not going to find a, uh, a Squirtle over here. That's a bit of a bummer. Anyway, getting into it, let's go back over here. Inside, and we want to grab out all of our first region biome starters. So, where's the Blastoise? He's my actual starter Pokemon, so this is pretty cool. Put him away for now, Cyndaquil. So, just to show off a little bit of these retextures, we'll put in a little freeze. Ah, uh, I hate it when that doesn't happen. Just to show them off a little better. I mean, if you want the full review, guys, definitely check out my uh, 2.5 update um, showcase. But uh, anyway, that's Charizard. Blastoise. Oh, he takes a while to load Blastoise. And Venusaur. Oh, that's sick, guys. Look at that. That is awesome. So, as you can see, Venusaur just had his leaves changed. But uh, these guys are legit new. So much better than what they once were. But uh, let's try and see what Charizard's flying speed is. Yeah, it's it's pretty slow. It's definitely slower than Zapdos, I'd say. But uh, damn, look at that animation. Can't argue with that animation. I want to ride him now. Ah, more Matangs. Just so many Matangs. It really does suck. Um, So let's go along and try to find ourselves... A nice little Totodile. Now, there's a beach biome over here, which has... Oh, that reminds me. We don't have Ray's minimap on. Oh, God. I'm sorry, guys. We'll get that going next episode. Once again, the Ray's minimap. Do I see a red snake over here? Just going to keep the eye out for the bosses. No. Anyway. So, yeah, there's a beach biome over here, and we can also find a Totodile there as well. So, we might as well hit, hit that up. Man, this Charizard's sick. Ah, should I go to bed first, or... Hmm. The only thing I really hate is that the whole flying speed in total is just so much slower. So, ugh, it's just, eh, it, it's what it is what it is. Um, anyway, uh, I would like to also thank you guys for the support we had last episode on the, uh, on the likes. You guys were killing it with those likes. I mean, it was just really great to see that you guys really do enjoy this update as much as I do. And, uh, yeah. But anyway, hopefully we can keep that up. But where is this beach biome? Oh, here it is. It's over here in this little cove. So, here we go. In this nice little cove. There's an Abra. What's that? That's oh, a Kingler. We've already got one. He's a Midget Kingler. Um, look at me just holding my height with my... With the, um... With the Charizard. But, uh, 
I did actually remember flying a Rayquaza and he was really fast. So I guess that's just the speed stat giving priority. Um, two Kadabras, a Psyduck's having a fight. Look at that. Two Kadabras, two Haunters, and two Psyduck's. And a Mareep. <laughs> oh, there's another one over there, actually. Anyway, let's try and go back to the beach. Hopefully get... Oh, I just realized the config for this isn't changed so that we might not get as many spawns. Oh... Actually, you know what? I think we might change that. Yeah, guys, I'm just going to quickly be back in two seconds. I'm just going to quickly change the config to make sure I get the spawns I normally had. Just makes it a little bit better trying to find more Pokemon. A little bit better. Yeah, I do. Oh, no, we're not. I just saw a blue boss in that F5 mode. A blue boss jinx. <laughs> a little bit more better. God, I'm really bad at my English sometimes. But who cares? Because we've got a nice blue boss right here. So, we'll hit him off with a Charizard. Alrighty, let's go. Flame Burst. 59, jeez. Oh, don't give me any... I bet you'll put me to sleep. Oh, Perish Song. Well, that was a stupid move. On your half, at least. Alright, let's hopefully... Perish Song... Yeah, here we go, you're dead. What was that? Oh, it made a noise when you killed him. It was like a da ding ding Alright, Snarl, Moon Ball, and a Net Ball. Ugh, that's pretty... It's quite ordinary loot, but uh, definitely, definitely worth uh, sticking around. Thank God I did a little random F5 mode on there. <laughs> that was just a little random. Um, keep an eye out with the, the zoom. Make sure I don't miss any. What are, is that Flaffy making that noise? It is too. So yeah guys, I'm just going to quickly BRB and make sure I have these right amount of spawns again. So back in two seconds. Alrighty guys, welcome back. So we got that nice and done. Got a few more spawns out and about. And there's a Chin Chow up there. He just dropped straight to the bottom. I wonder if I should go ahead and get him. Um... Ah, uh, now nah, we'll come back and get him one other day. Oh, Abra moves now. That's weird. There was a Psyduck around there. So hopefully there's a couple more spawns around. Now it would be great to try and get this uh, this nice little Totodile already. Um, let's take on this train and try and get ourselves a fishing rod. Might come in handy later on at least. Um, so we'll go with Slasher. So let's go, Scott. Oh, Slasher's got that new noise. Say right there. <laughs> oh, there's a new textured war turtle. Oh. Oh, Shelter has a new thing as well. Shelter, Shelter! <laughs> that sounds so weird. This is cool though, getting to listen to all the new sounds. Oh no, we're confused. No. Come on, get out. There we go, Starmie now. Oh, it's Psychic type, isn't it? Yes. And another War Turtle. Am I out of X's yet? X's are for days. Alrighty. And done. No rod. Dang it. It is a pretty rare drop from the fisherman, but I mean, you gotta be in it to win it, so might as well try and there's a new textured Pidgey. Oh, who's going to fight me as well? Alrighty, thanks for the heads up. Um, just, yeah, what's his name? Cloyster is getting really, really leveled up. Really, really leveled up. Really, really, um, what would be the way to say it? Really, really advanced. He's level 50 at the moment, and now he's nearly got Ice School Crash. Ah, oh, slow bro. Dang it. Um, this is Starmie. Uh, let's get on our... Oh, damn. All my Pokemon have fainted except Slasher. Oh, no, we have Shell Shocker. We can ride him home. Alrighty. Up. Oh, and... Take me home. I think he can now go underwater as well. I think. As a horsey. Alrighty, let's... How do we go down in the water? Oh, wow, he like... Oh, there's a Chinchow. When it's like a thing, if you like jump, he, he skips a little bit. <laughs> Look at him. He's like hurdles. <laughs> He's actually really fast though. Damn, I think it might be better to just use him on water now compared to flying. Because the flying types, they just you know, they just weren't performing. I mean, I don't know I don't know about this magic card. I don't know if I like him or not. Actually, I want to show you guys the new grilled um the grilled magic carps and or Gyarados. So Actually, yeah, I'll show that off to you guys. So, if you guys missed on the live stream, uh, we you would have seen Mr. M tried to show off his new and improved uh, Gyarados. So, pretty much what it was is it is a grilled uh, Magikarp that is either evolved or or simply just um, burnt in its uh, final stage. So, we're going to check that out. It's pretty demented. I'm not going to lie. Viewer discretion is advised. Um, <laughs> alright, I just wanted to say that. Okay, let's get, we're nearly home. Nearly on our way home. I'm gonna ride my Scyther home. 
You're quite fast, aren't you? Oh, yes, we are riding Scyther every day. Holy crap. This must look, this, this must look funny. <laughs> oh, my God. This is the best. We are always riding Scyther every day of the week, no matter what. Oh, my God. It's just the best. Oh, he can't fly. He can double jump, though. That's sweet. Definitely the best to ride. Anyway. Oh, we need to make races out of that on servers and stuff. That's going to be crazy. Anyway. Let's get in here. Take our fish and eat it. Get a nice heal. And they'll get out this magic carp and Gyarados and show it off to you guys. So, it's like a... It's not even burnt anymore. It's like literally a zombie at this stage. So, let's finish that up. And go over here. Put... Put our Kanto starters away. They've had the little show off. I'm going to get... Gyarados and Magikarp. Flint and Steel. Where's my Flint and Steel at, yo? Where's my Flint and Steel at? There it is. Alrighty. So, first off, I'm going to show you guys the new updated Grilled Magikarp. So, you guys know how if you burn it and then put it away. Oh, was that? Oh, Beldum! Oh, Beldum, Beldum, Beldum! Oh my god, a Beldum, finally! There's three of them, too. Four? Three of them. Oh, I thought they didn't spawn. Holy crap. Okay, guys, we've got to take... Screw the Grilled Magikarp. We're, we're going for Beldum. We're catching a Beldum here. So, um... Beldum. Beldum. We're going to... Let's go with Scyther. Let's get the level 19 one. And we'll go... Ball Swipe. Oh, we might need to do a couple of these, guys. It's not effective. Alright, one more. Oh, did it take recall damage? Okay, we gotta watch these guys. They take recall damage. At least there's three of them. Thank God. Alrighty. False swipe. Oh, we didn't die that time. Okay. He's gonna die if he uses it again. So we're gonna use Ultra Ball. I, I almost want to use a Master Ball at this stage. Just because I don't want to miss out. Alrighty, one. That's two. Oh, he's gonna kill himself. No. Sounds good. Alright. Go Ultra Ball. I think I'm going to maybe switch and put him to sleep, maybe. What's that across? Oh, it's a Butterfree. So that was a weird change of events. Uh, he's going to die now when I switch to Vile Plume. Ready? Dead. No, he's not taking recoil damage for some reason. I put him to sleep. Or at least... Oh, I don't have to sleep. I have Paralyzed. Well, that'll at least um, stop him from killing himself. And then Ultra Ball. He does have a really, really hard catch rate. I remember the devs were talking about it. Um... I think it was almost impossible to catch at one stage, but Matang was stupidly easy. I, I'm thinking of using the Master Ball here, guys. Now, you're probably thinking, wow, you're so stupid, but I don't need it for anything else. Its catch rate's ridiculous. And I think we might got it. Oh, I can't see. Oh, yes, we got it. We got it, guys. Sweet. Well, that, I, I have heard it's got a, a catch rate similar to Mew. Oh, what the hell? Oh, Nid Arena female wants to fight. Come on, get him. Get him, get him, get him. Alright, now we need some food, damn it. We got no food. We're gonna die. Oh, run, 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 run. So I'll, I'll show off the grilled magic carp in a second. Uh, let's get it. Ugh, okay. I'm 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 healing. We're healing. It's all good. It's all fine. We're healing. Whew. Oh, no, we're healing the Pokemon, not my health. Holy crap. I'm an idiot. Okay. Get the... Bread. I wonder if I was about to die and lose my levels then. Because I think it stops. There we go. Any more food? I'm running real low on this food, man. It's a poison potato. That's not going to help with much. Um, There's a steak there, an uncooked steak. And, oh, bread. That'll help at least. I'll cook this. And I'll check all the other furnaces. Nope, 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 nope. And, nope. Well, that's great. But, uh, anyway. On to the grilled magic cup. So, this is your new magic cup. Oh, there's an arrow on right there. i got to make sure I slow it down. And make sure not to get all of the Pokemon in one go. Because that, that's not fun. Anyway. Magic cup. Oh, he was a pygmy one, wasn't he? Oh. Set yourself on fire. Alright, guys. So, there, there it is. Um, it's new grilled magic cup texture. It looks much better. Really clean. Really good. Anyway, let's get 
And let's try and get our Gyarados to that stage. So he's a big one. No, it doesn't look like you can do it on Gyarados. You have to evolve the Magikarp. Alrighty, so that works. Let's do that. So, let's get a Shiny Shell. And go for a Blizzard. And he got... Oh, he won off. He's one off. Come on. What what do we got here? There's, a, there's an Aaron. There's a Dudrio. That'll do. Who cares? And if it doesn't, then I'll be pissed. Shiny Shell. Getting them levels. Alrighty. Razor Shell. Oh, I wanted to use Aurora Beam. It still works. Magic Carpet level 20. What's going on here? Do they change the level that Magic Carpet involves? Or what's going on? Does it need to be a higher level, or am I just doing something wrong? Maybe there's a secret recipe that I don't know about, guys. Well, I'll show you guys next update anyway what that is. I mean, next video. But, uh, well, we still got some time left. It's, oh, there's a Matang. I mean, I got the belt. Oh, wow, I'm already, like, out of hunger. I think I'm on, like, a hard difficulty. Um, options. Difficulty. Easy. That's more like it. Because we're easy. It's a ditto over there, right? Yep, that's a ditto. Um, so, Johto starters, yeah? Johto starters? Let's put Magic Carpet away. He was uh, he was good, but he can't fly him at the moment, so he's not that good. Um, I think we might go a little bit, of, do a little bit of a farm at the end of this episode just to get some things. So we're gonna do that now. Where's my Well Palmer? Wellmer Pale, not the Wellmer Paler. People get irritated when I do that. Where's these bosses at? I did find an a boss last episode and a boss this episode, so I'm not complaining. But I am complaining about the flickering um, thing in the back that's really annoying. Oh, an Ivysaur! Ivysaur has like the same rarity as a freaking Bayleaf. I wouldn't have been happy with a Bayleaf though. I want to I want a Chicka Rita, nothing else, nothing more. Oh, what the hell? Who are you? Oh, they have an untextured trainer. His name's George, isn't it? I don't know, well, it's probably different versions of it, but yeah. They do. Uh, they're, they're, not, they're not very cool at the moment. I don't do anything. Uh, anyway. Anyway. Let's uh, go through and steal some potatoes. So, I think there's potatoes over here. These are potatoes, correct? Yep. These are the potatoes. So, we want to try and get as many of these as possible. And they're all just going <laughs> Oh, don't tell me they're nerfed. Oh, they nerfed it. <gasps> they nerfed it. Guys, they nerfed it. No. No, they nerfed it. Oh, damn it. What if it does it still work on wheat? We'll find out. We'll grab a couple. I mean, if it works on wheat, it's still semi-decent, but... Oh, where is the whale palm? There it is. Oh, snap. Crackle and pop. Well, that's... That's something. Um, looks like all the Pokemon have just absolutely trod on all of the farm and messed it up completely. I know I'm standing on it, but that doesn't affect it, right? No. Ah, I fell. So, now I have to dig this. Which is so, so, so great. Let's just eat a little bit just so I don't die. Oh, I just got my first achievement. That's cute. Um, so, yeah, let's just get some of this as food, and then I'm gonna have to try and get some legit food now that the Whale Palmer. Well, my pail is not super OP, which is quite unfortunate. I liked how OP it was. I think it was pretty balanced. Nah, in all seriousness, no, it was pretty damn OP. It's just gonna be an absolute bitch to get food on the GLG server again, though. I, I haven't updated the GLG server yet, so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna farm an F ton of bread, and then update it, <laughs> because <laughs> like, I don't want to just be sitting the whole 2.5 update showing you guys how to make bread. So, <laughs> anyway, um, I might as well replant the best I can without taking too long. Um, so I can come back here and get it later. Planted a different thing. Now, I don't want to plant any potatoes. I'm taking the potatoes with me. I don't really care about that. That's happening. Oh. What's that? Flaffy's head. Absolute troll. Imagine if that was a shiny golden and I just sniped it. Oh my god, I'm sick of falling. Holy crap. I just want to fly my Charizard home. I'll just get all rid of all these seeds and then I'm out of here. So out of here. Do I have any more seeds? Good. Because they're 
getting thrown away, thrown away, don't pick up, and Charizard, let's go, fly me home, fly me home, let's not eat anymore, let's try to stand still when we get inside, is he slow because it's me, or, hmm, anyway, inside, cook to potatoes, I can eat that steak, sweet, now I'm not going to die, and then I want to craft, oh, I can sprint, yay, I want to craft as much of this as I can. And craft, craft, and trash. Leaving trash in my own house. I know, very smart. Very, very smart. Well, it looks like we got a decent, decent amount of food. I mean, it'll probably last me two episodes at this rate. But I changed it back down to normal, so... Sorry, easy. So it might be a little bit easier. Look, you got the feather on your head, Dinorino. What are you doing? But uh, anyways, guys, I think we're going to end the episode there. So hopefully you guys did enjoy the episode. Uh, if you did, don't forget to leave a like below. And I will see you guys next time in the next episode of Pixelmon Survival. See ya.